everybody, my name is Kimberly and this is my YouTube channel. Today I will show you 5 DIY K-pop room decor and this is also a collaboration with my good friend Rainier here on YouTube. He will also be doing some K-pop DIY so I will leave his video in the description down below. And if you like this video and like to see more K-pop DIY, be sure to subscribe and like this video at any time. So comment down below which one was your favorite and let's get on with the video. So first you're going to need some paper mache letters. And then you'll need some scissors, a pen, a ruler, some green foam, and some fake flowers. First, you'll cut out the top part of the letter and then grab your green foam and cut it into smaller pieces so it can fit the letter. So you will have something like this and don't worry if it's not perfect because you just have to cover up with the actual flowers. So then you just have to stick on the flowers as according to the letter and start arranging the petals so that the foam won't actually show. So you have something like this and then you just have to do the exact same thing with the other letters. First, you're gonna need a mason jar, some black and yellow paint, a paintbrush, an exacto knife, and some duct tape. So, first, you get the duct tape and draw on a VIP sign like this and cut it out. So, then you open your mason jar and stick the duct tape inside. So, then you have something like this. And afterwards, you get your black paint and start painting the inside of the jar. Also, I would recommend a black paint that is not matte, more like a glossy one so that it won't chip off when you're painting it. Also, try not to get any paint where the duct tape is. Next, grab your X-Acto knife and start peeling off the duct tape from inside. Then grab your yellow paint and start painting the logo from inside. And if it doesn't work, try to paint it from the outside as well. And then you have something like this. Bing, bang. Bing, bing, bang. For this DIY, you're going to need a clock, EXO pictures, some double-sided tape, and some scissors. So first you're going to get your EXO pictures and cut them all out. Then you're going to grab your clock and flip it the other side and you're going to cut around this corner. You just need this part. Once you have that part, then you're going to get your EXO pictures and arrange them as the numbers on the clock. Then you're going to use some double sided tape and tape everything onto the wall. For this DIY, you need some rocks, black acrylic paint, some white puffy paint, and a paintbrush. First, you're going to paint on the black paint onto the rock, all of it, or just the first side. I then grabbed an image of Winner's logo and sketched it onto the rock in pencil as an outline. I also did this for Big Bang and Icon. I then filled it in with white puffy paint and this is how it came out. For this last DIY, you're gonna need white cardstock paper, a ruler, BTS images, and some twine or vine, and some clothespins to hang them on. First, you are going to place the image on the cardstock and measure at least one inch from the actual photo, so the cardstock will look like a Polaroid picture. And then you're going to cut that out and use it as a template for the other photos. Once you have all of them cut out, you would then grab one and outline the photo. Then you will cut from the outline but only leave less than half of an inch from the outline so you're not actually cutting the outline. So 
So you'll have something like this and the photo will fit perfectly. Then you will flip it over and start mod podging the edges and sides of the photo onto the cardstock. You will have something like this. Now do the same with the other photos. Well, that was the end of my video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, leave it a thumbs up and subscribe. And also leave me a comment down below what would you guys want me to do next. And also check out Rainier's video on his channel. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Bye!